soul is lonely, sad and blue Ain't got no loving shoulders to lean on There's always a sunny side across the river Take a ride, take a swim and all your worries go away Go cross the river and you'll be fine Go counting winners, it's right down the line You'll be alright from sunny side Peoples, hope you guys are doing fantastic. Beautiful day. Beautiful day here in the AK. Not super, super hot, but like sunshiny and like little breeze. It's wonderful. Guys, I have to show you before we even kick off today's vlog. Do you know what it's gonna be? Do you know? Do you know what it's gonna be? moly it made our driveway area so much bigger it's kind of crazy oh my goodness gracious that is super exciting bittersweet in a sense because that's like the final thing that had to go for uh, our business in case you don't know we just recently sold our HVAC control business a big giant semi trailer that has been sitting in our yard for three plus years uh, ever since we built this place bittersweet but I'm not gonna lie, I don't miss it in my yard. So I'm gonna share with you guys that that all transpired. As you guys know, the trailer, the office trailer already went. As you saw earlier this morning, did you see the cute little moose? Oh my goodness, we have a mom and twin babies that are around in our area, have been so stinking cute. We're very cautious, very mindful because uh, mama moose are very protective of those little babies. Get in between a mama and a baby moose, it will not end well for you. So we need to keep our distance and just uh, pay attention when we go outside or while we are outside just to be aware, but they are so stinking cute and I think they might be eyeballing my garden. You saw in the morning as well, um, we had to get our backup truck, like our work truck that I've had since I was like 16, 16 years old I got that truck. Uh, and it's been with us ever since. It's been a phenomenal truck. We've used it on all kinds of construction projects and house builds and rental builds that we've done. Uh, but Bert had to get that up and going because the battery died on it. Uh, sitting all winter, kind of took it out. So grateful that little truck's still around. Today, today's video, we are going to head on into Fairbanks and we're gonna go to Costco. We have run out of most of our essentials, like our milks, our eggs, things like that, some vegetables, just, need a restock essentially. So we're gonna head on into town, show you all the things, show you all the pricing. Family of five living in North Pole, Alaska, how much will it cost to essentially just refreshen up the fridge, refreshen up the pantry just a little bit, all those things. Come along, we head on into town and go to Costco. Alrighty guys, I made it to the old Costco. We're gonna run in, gonna go see all the things that we can find. We have a pretty extensive list. Here we go. Pretty extensive list. Totally left it at home on my desk. Good time. 
my husband so graciously sent me a picture. I just got kind of the normal things. Might try to see if I can get a big container of yogurt. Um, we've been doing some more smoothies around in the house. Some, some more frozen rotisserie chicken. Guys, if you've not tried their frozen rotisserie chicken, it is awesome. Pop that in the air fryer. You can just eat it plain. I've been really trying to up, up my protein intake. So yes, uh, I stopped by and got a yummy, it's called a blush berry. Um, it's like a tea, super yummy. Run in, try to beast out this Costco. To take you inside, show you some prices, see what it's looking like. Costco for the most part is super on trend with like the lower 48. We don't see a huge price increase, which is super awesome. Uh, Cause normally when you buy things in Alaska, it's more expensive because it just costs a lot more to get it here. So, but for what we've seen with Costco, they are pretty seamless. We're gonna go see, we're gonna check it out. I'm sure I'll find some extra things that I throw into my cart that's not on the list. Do you do that? What are you the biggest sucker for when it comes to going into a grocery store? Is it like a fun baked good that you find? Is it a super good deal that you can't pass up? Let me know, comments below. Probably fall custom to most of them. All right, let's go shopping. Hey guys, does your local Costco sell dip nets? We have them here. Fishing season. What are you guys noticing at your local Costco's? Are you seeing price increases, low, keeping about the same stock issues? Let me know, comments below. All right, let's keep on moving. Alright guys, making our way through 
so nice to see happy people. Thank you guys so much for saying hi. It just literally makes my day of being able to say hi to you guys. This is what I got. Close. Like everything, they still don't have soup, which is kind of sad, but that's okay. I can make my own, can it? So let me know, comments below. What do you think? How much you thinking? Let me know. All right, let's go check out. up a chocolate sundae for grandma, great grandma. She loves anything chocolate, essentially. So I'm gonna go give her this, and then Audrey is working there today, so I got her a hot dog. <laughs> so we're gonna go drop these off real quick, and then we'll head on home, share with you all the pricing, all the things on how much my total wound up being. I definitely noticed some increasing of pricing. I did notice that, like waters, $4 or so, like a little over four, and it's like a little over six now, so. Interesting, so let's meander. We'll head on back home, drop this stuff off real quick, and then uh, I'll see you guys back at home. You an ice cream, Grandma. Thank you. You're welcome. I can put it in the freezer if you're not feeling it right now. I will eat it right now. You'll eat it right now. All right. Give me a spoon. Okay. Here you go. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh my, that's good, and I love chocolate. I know. They just didn't have a shake, but that's a Sunday, so. Mm. Good. Either a shake or a Sunday. Either one. Either one is good. Okay. Bye. Bye. Love you. Great grandma said bye too. Okay, bye great grandma. Love you too. Love you, see you. Hey guys, I wanted to show you real quick before we go show all the groceries and pricing and stuff of, you remember when we did like a freezer haul on what we were able to, you know, we wanted to just get some freezer items stocked away. This is where we're kind of currently sitting. Really, really good. Like I feel like we have been able to just kind of slowly go through different things. That's awesome. Sadly, this was the rotisserie chicken that I was trying to find at Costco. Didn't have any uh, on hand. So next time I go, hopefully I'll be able to get some. I'll show you quick update. This is what the freezer is looking like. Pretty good. All right. Let's go tell you how much everything costs. Here she is. How much do you think it costs for all these little dealios? Okay. So remember how I asked in the beginning, what is your like, Oh, I, that wasn't on my list, but I'm totally going to get it. I'll show you what that was for me. So this little guy, that's not a normal thing. I got that for a family movie night. We normally do Friday family movie nights and having like a special treat is super, super fun. So I picked that up. This is new, cheese and fruit and nut packs. Um, I thought it'd be great for just a quick snack on the go and we just forget to eat. A lot of times that happens is then we're like, oh man, we're so hungry. This would be super good and for Evelyn to take to gym. This is not a normal buy. This guy right here, it was on sale. And I thought it'd be just like a fast dinner option. I think I'll make some Alfredo sauce with it. Before I run, that's what that will be for. Lemons, I got more than I would normally get for lemons, but we've been doing this thing um, where we actually juice all these lemons and then um, put them in ice cube trays and have like little lemon bricks and then I just throw them in water or throw them in like sparkling water super super good and you get that lemon water uh, which is really really good for you I'm trying to implement that um other than that coconut water we really don't have a whole lot of but like I said we're trying to do some more smoothie options and we use that in our smoothies total for everything so in Fairbanks they do not have a sales tax 
So keep that in mind, in North Pole they do. And total for all the things is $289.89. Let me know. Comparison to where you are at. First time we've ever bought um, the squeeze tubes of the sour cream. Our Costco didn't have these, so super awesome. We much prefer these compared to the tub. Yeah, let me know, comments below guys. How does it compare to your Costco? This is just kind of like a restock of things that we were essentially out of. Put a little bit more of this back in, into my freezer. Um, we really, really enjoyed our uncured black forest ham. We've been actually eating that quite a bit. So thank you guys so much for coming along with me. I hope you enjoyed it. If you enjoy these Costco videos, give it a thumbs up. Let me know that you do like them um, and it really helps out our channel. So thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.